Leave it 851, turn right heading 180. 014 Papa, turn right 245, report localizer established. Today, the Oceania region is definitely getting a bit of a special and a lot of focus with a double upload focusing on two different airlines in very close proximity, both releasing some intriguing news over the past 24 hours. Moving away from our previous video, that being with Qantas in Australia, we head to none other than New Zealand with flag carrier Air New Zealand announcing plans to adjust their own fleet in the coming years when it comes to their long haul operations. Following the airline posting its financial results, which were rather bleak, but to be expected given the tough restrictions still impacting the country when it comes to international travel, which for Air New Zealand in the past was crucial for their revenues, they have gone on to say that they'll be phasing out all of their Boeing 777-300 aircraft and therefore move forward with a Boeing 787-only long-haul fleet of aircraft. This is sadly not the first time we've seen an announcement made regarding the Boeing 777's future within their fleet as they have already said goodbye to their 777-200s, the shorter variant, and might I add, this was indeed an accelerated retirement of this aircraft. The Boeing 777-300s within the airline were featured around the world, stretching even into London. This is when the airline flew previously into the location. They could also have been seen in the United States, like that of Los Angeles. In addition, they could be seen across the pond in Australia, on the most demanding and busier services to the likes of Melbourne and Sydney. They were even seen to destinations within Asia and the various islands off the shores of New Zealand and in the Pacific region. On your screen now, with thanks to Air New Zealand provided in their press release, we're getting a better indication of how the airline has not only evolved since 2010 when it comes to aircraft and how they are currently, but also we're getting a perfect look into their streamlined future. A common theme we're seeing widely across the aviation industry is airlines reducing the overall aircraft types that they operate in favour of being more streamlined and operating only a handful of types that are incredibly efficient. The airline will by 2027 only therefore fly four aircraft types with the Boeing 787s, A320 family including that of the A320 and A321 Neos, the ATR-72s and the Q300s for their more regional domestic operations. The reception, while has been a shock, has actually been welcomed in by many people who are excited to see the future of the airline with a total of 20 Boeing 787s mixed between not just the Dash 9 but also the larger and longer Dash 10 being used only in the future for their long-haul flights. What are your thoughts on the developments within Air New Zealand? And if you haven't already seen the earlier video, there's actually some exciting news surrounding Qantas and their Airbus A380. So I definitely recommend after finishing this up to go and check that out if you haven't already. Thank you very much for the support. I hope you have been enjoying the regular content across this channel and also my second channel. Until the next video, take care and be safe like I always say.